mm, then we sleep through day, then we play all through the late night. Sleep through day, then we play all through the late night. All through the late night. Si vous play, don't you hate? All through the late night. All through the late night. I'm back and this is going to be a quick tutorial. I initially wanted this video to be a get ready with me video but I waited kind of too late in the day to start recording so I couldn't do the hair part as well but um, I want to make a separate video for that. But this is going to be on my purple makeup look and I really really love how it came out. I don't think I've done a glitter tutorial. Um, I don't think I've ever done a glitter tutorial, which is insane. So for the new year, I'm starting off right with, of course, a makeup tutorial. I'm so excited to be back. I'm going to be consistent with you guys from now on. I know I say that all the time, but I really am this year. So get ready to see a whole bunch of me. Um, this look is super easy to recreate. Um, didn't take a long time and it's easy for beginners as well and I just really like it. I think it stands out. I think it's beautiful. It's eye-catching and it's not too much. It's not too dramatic. Um, you can always tone down this look as well um, with a lighter lip. You know me. I like the dramatics. I want to go all out, go hard or go home. So I did the dark purple lip, paired it. So um, I paired this with a dark purple lip and I just love it. I think it's really think pretty it's good um, for whenever, whenever you feel like rocking glitter and just want to be cute, go ahead and try this out. So I'm going to stop talking now and let's get started with the tutorial. Okay, you guys, so I already did one eye um, just for time's sake. So I'm going to go ahead and start on this eye. I'm using LA Girls um, Concealer for my base. And I'm just this gonna look apply is that. so pretty. I haven't used, I haven't done a glitter look in like forever. And it's all gloomy and rainy outside. So I'm like, I'm gonna do a glitter look. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and go in with saddle. And it's gonna be my crease go color. Ahead and apply that directly to my crease. Little windshield wiper motions. And this color is so good like it's such a good transition color you can always like i think it works good on any skin tone so saddle is like my all-time favorite transition crease color satellite dreams and it's so funny because i got this when i first started doing makeup and i still love it it's still such a pretty color so i'm just gonna go ahead and place that right on top in my crease just directly in there and I'm just going back and forth windshield wiper motion I'm just going to take it a little bit higher than what I usually would as well because I want that purple to show up really well Fig one and a smaller shader brush right on the outer corner and going up. Just right in that corner. And like I said, just pop it right in there and blend up. I the only one like my eyes water like crazy when I do my makeup I'm just like ugh. and sometimes when I do clients it's so funny because if I do their waterline you either have the client that's okay with it and they're just like it's nothing or the client that's gonna shed tears like crazy I'm the one that's gonna shed tears like crazy so anyway now that we have that then I'm going to go ahead and go in with my highlight and my highlight is Naked Lunch. Oh, on my brow bone. <laughs> now I just like to pack on my highlight and just blend that out. Like so. And now the fun part, I'm, we're going to go ahead and glitter that I'm using is by Recollections. Hope you guys can see that. 
Okay, there we go. Uh, Recollections, and I'm using LA Splash um, Adhesive. I'm gonna put that all over my lid. And you kinda gotta work fast with this because um, it does dry quickly. So I'm just packing, gonna pack it on there. And I really like to do my foundation last when doing glitter looks, like that's a must in my look because you see how much fallout you're gonna get. I'm just applying lashes and I got these I think from CVS I don't even remember the name of them just any kind of lashes but so now I'm gonna go ahead and apply my foundation I'm using uh, this is a Kat Von D sample that I had my Sephora was out of my color so um, this is the Kat Von D I believe like the tattoo makeup or something like that and I really really like it because um, it's a good color match for me and um, it really like goes on nicely and looks like skin so I'm just going to go ahead and apply that. And as you can see, it looks really nice and natural. And I'm using the LA Girl Concealer. I like to drag it down just a little bit. And so then um, I'm going to go ahead and use my other concealer in a little bit of a darker color. This one is in Beautiful Bronze. And go ahead and contour with the Gucci face. Chisel it out like so. So I like to let it sit for just a little while to thicken it. Um, I just think that it lasts a little bit longer throughout the day when I do that. So I'm just going to go ahead and sit and let it dry a little bit. And then we're going to go ahead and set. So now we let it so now that we let it sit for a little bit, I'm just gonna go ahead and blend it on down. And I just like to set it right away. That's just my technique. You guys can blend everything out, but I just like to set it as soon as I finish. Uh, I find that it helps me not crease as much because I have some fine lines under my so I just knock this step out. Before um, I move on to the next side. Okay, so I'm back. <laughs> So um, I've already applied my under eye highlighter. I set it. So I'm just going to go ahead and blend out. I like to just take a little bit off as I go. Keep cleaning the brush. And then I'm going to go ahead and blend that nose area down as well. Now I'm just going to go ahead and blend that highlight down as well. I'm going to just use my finger to do that. So 
And I'm gonna go ahead and set. And I'm just gonna use my It palette, Ish palette. And I'm gonna go ahead and use that dark, darkest um, console color. And just go right in. And I'm just using circular motion so it's evenly diffused. And this doesn't look like one sharp line just going down my face. Apply that and set the rest of my face. I'm just gonna go ahead and prep my lips and just using good old Vaseline. And I'm using um, the Gerard Cosmetics highlight. This one, I don't know the name of it because I cleaned my makeup and it came off, but um, I'll look it up and definitely put it in the description bar for anybody that is interested. So like so, voila. Go ahead and use Dirty Plum to tie it in with the purple. And then last and final step, we're gonna go ahead and do I'm this. using a really pretty color. Um, this is by NYX and this is the Intense Gloss and this one is in Black Cherry. So well, that completes this look you guys i hope that you enjoyed this tutorial thank you so much for watching if you did be sure to thumbs up the video and leave a comment if you're not subscribed already press that button and subscribe and thank you guys again so much for watching and i'll see you guys all in my next video Mwah. bye